Good morning. So, Zoe's going to tell you all about what we're doing today. Um, dog. What is it? Day of the dog? And you go around and there's like dog stuff. And there's puppy yoga and I, I'm so excited. So, this is an event that happens near Victoria in Buller, Bullen, Bullo Park. It's a two-day event. I feel like you just guessed that. Well, it's Buller or Bullen. I can't remember. Um, and I seen it was happening, and so I kind of mentioned it to Zoe, and she was like, well, I don't know if we should go. Just kidding. She's pretty excited, because apparently it brings like 25,000 people. And in Zoe's words were, there's going to be 25,000 people there and like something like that. So that means 25,000 <laughs> people bringing their dogs. And I was like, yep. And so she's like, let's go. Never been. Um, so we're going to go check that out and see what that's about in Buller Park. I want to say it's Buller Park. So yeah, starts at 11. It's Sunday today, 11 to 4. Yesterday, Saturday. Let's go all day. It's supposed to be hot today too, like in the 30s so i don't know we'll see we'll go and check it out and we will bring you guys along with us <laughs> let's go so we're here at pet uh palooza berlin park i figured out it's the day of the dog we already seen like a whole bunch of dogs everywhere so it's exciting oh look there goes one right there where is he brown lab okay let's go see what we can see chocolate Chocolate lab, sorry. Oh my goodness. We're not gonna like this at all. Oh look, look at these this dog's posing from the big dog. <laughs> That's cute actually. Oh there's a little pug over there. Yeah, it looks like there's a bunch of vendors and so so far. There's been vendors and like photo ops for dogs. This is the best dog ever photo op. Um, there is dogs everywhere. We just got to pet a pug. And there's like, you can enter into the different draws. And if you're looking for a Tesla, they have some over there, which is weird, but you know, might have food. They have first aid kits over there, which was kind of neat for dogs. Oh, see, look at you guys. Look at all the dogs everywhere. It's so great. Yeah. So they have dogs that you can adopt here. And they have all the information. And then over here they have puppy yoga. Yeah. You get to the yoga with puppies. The pink little booth here and get brunch. Your choice of an account. This photo op. And they give you the goggles to put on your dog. This is like the best place ever. Look at all the dogs. They're everywhere. They have pool parties for the dogs. By Collab Barbershop Collective, by donation to the Victoria Bulldog Society. Or if you want to get your hair braided. They have like a foam fest for dogs. So your dog to run through. Piper, if you can hear your voice, or your, your name. Sorry, it's still early. I'm sorry, I'm just waking up. Piper, you're going to be in lane number two. Charlie in lane number three. Frankie in lane number four. And Millie in lane number five. Each round is going to move on to the finals, where they're going to get a chance to win some amazing prizes, and I will list them. So they get a chance to win a crown, a scepter, a key, and of course, some prizes from Pet Store Victoria, Mystical Tail Dot Gear, Tilted Barn Petco, Natural Balance, A Can Foods, and Best Dog Treats Ever. <laughs> All right, Corgis, are you ready? Catchers, are you ready? I better stand out the orange line here. All right, three, two, one, go! And again, the dogs don't actually have to go to the owner they came with. Piper. 
Piper's. So there's like a little dog restaurant here. And like, yeah, they're eating their little, their little dish that they order. That is so funny. They're putting lays on dogs. You guys, this is like the best place ever. Honestly, best place ever. Um, Humane Society has like a whole table of um, like really, 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 really cheap brand new products like pet bowls for like a buck, uh, collars for two bucks, toys for like a buck or two. We load it up like big time. Um, but yeah, this place is awesome. This is another photo op. A Superman. I mean, look at this guy. So this is um, our haul from the... What was it called again? So, Papalooza. So full disclosure, we did pay for this, which was five bucks. We paid for this, which was a dollar. We paid for this, which was two dollars we paid for the muffle the treat muffle two bucks we paid for this which was a dollar the rest was all free free so we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve twelve sample size bags of dog food slash cat food we got this recovery health and joint we got four little um, beef stick treats. This is a highlighter, a sticker, a whole bunch of like other little puppy treats. Oh, I did buy this too. This was a dollar dog shampoo. Um, what? sorry. These, this, though he was super happy about, was free. The Bark magazine was free. Candy for humans was free. We got a training clicker for free. We got three cans of cat food, white cat food, a couple pans, a couple pads, a tick remover, sanitizing pen. Oh, that's a little sample of treats. And yeah, it was uh, amazing. And we were only there for, what do you want to say, like maybe an hour and a half? Yeah. yeah, it was really surprising to me how much they actually give away. And I'm sure we could have gotten more. It's just that we didn't go to every booth and ask for things. Yeah. But, yeah. Our puppies will be super happy. So I played with too many dogs today. She's tired. I barely even... Like, you didn't really get to, like, play with them. No, but we got to pet a lot. I got to pet a lot. And admire a lot. Um, I got to pet the Whippet. Okay. And you got to get slobbered on by a... Basset hound. Basset hound. <laughs> All right. For somebody who's 14 years of age and a dog lover... What did you think of the pet alooza? Um, it was great. What was your favorite part? I don't know, the free stuff. <laughs> like that's what my dogs are gonna like the most is the free stuff. Um, um I like the little events they have, like dog racing and dog yoga and it's a dangerous place, I think. Because they have like adoption stands. Puppies are so cute. I, we, we had a great time. Like, I don't know if we're geeks or what. We went. We didn't have a dog. We didn't care. We went. It, it's much better with a dog. It would be so much fun with a dog. Like, you go to every little vendor and they give you the dog a little treat. You're, like, the penny would have been, like, so mm -hmm. full. They had, like, a, the pup pool so your dog could cool off. Um, what else did they have? They had the corgi races and then another bunch of different races. They literally a dog restaurant. <laughs> they did. I, I think I vlogged that one. You go up and yeah, you order your your dog, his choice or her choice of meal and they give it in a little bowl and it was just great. Um, 
yeah, I, I, it was great. Like it was the best day ever. And I think I kept saying that over and over and over again. We got tons of free stuff. Like, and even like the Humane Society was selling stuff for like, cheap and this was like new stuff that has like from the store i think it was like pet smart stuff or a lot of it came from pet we smart got like a hundred dollar worth of stuff and it was like twelve dollars yeah um it was basically like a trade show for dogs and so many dogs like there were so many different kinds of dogs like i think we just i don't know i just like looking at all the dogs um definitely wasn't twenty five thousand people no, but I'm wondering that was probably meant like within, you know, the whole weekend because uh, it didn't feel super busy and it didn't feel packed. And it was actually like the it was smaller than I thought it was going to be, but also better than I thought it was going to be. There was tons of like little photo ops that you could do with your dog. I seen a ball pit for your dog. I seen like a little uh, like foam foam fest we've done foam fest before where your dogs could like run through the foam um they soap. yeah basically just soap bubbles they had food trucks which was nice like for if you wanted to eat we never ate there but and, like the races that the the winner actually like won a prize oh there was a bunch of draws too that we en went around and entered we didn't win anything but we don't know that i haven't checked my email yet true i checked mine i didn't win anything <laughs> Um, but yeah, it was great. It was free. It was a free event. I do want to, to say that. Um, I think it only happens once a year. I, I didn't even know about it. Like we were getting off the ferry and I saw this big sign saying, you know, whatever. I'm so glad you saw a sign because yeah, yeah. I was like, oh, I'll research them. There's so many things that I got that is just amazing that I wanted for a long time, but I didn't want to like buy it. Like, um, I, I know this is an art word, the, the, the ball throw or the tennis ball throw where you like put the tennis ball in and then one of those clicker things that's supposed to be good for like training. Yeah. We would have actually probably stayed longer except for the fact that it was very hot. hot. Like it was hot out today. It was like 30 degrees or whatever. And so we decided to leave, but yeah, it was just it's wonderful if you guys are down here and you love dogs and even if you don't have your dog with you i still suggest going because nobody was like we didn't have our dogs with us but nobody but, like denied us yeah they were, we didn't have a dog yeah exactly like they would ask us what kind of animal we have because like, and i will say it's not just dog stuff they also had it's mostly dog stuff mostly dog stuff but they did give us cat samples they had like a cat grooming service there some of the draws we didn't even put our name in because we're not locals and so it was stuff like free grooming well we're not gonna be able to use that 10 free dog walks and yeah 10 free dog like you know we're not gonna that, and that's with our luck that's probably what we would have wanted is something we can't use so i guess we could have given it to like family we have family members down here it was fantastic it was free i would highly recommend going if you love dogs like if you love dogs this is the place for you even if you don't have your dog, go. And they will, you are just as welcome. Is it yearly or was that just a one-time thing? It was yearly because I looked it up and yeah, they were like, I don't know how long it's been writing for, but it's it was definitely, we need something like that up in the north. Mm. <sighs> really, but anyway, it was great. And I think we are going to call it a night so it's the end of the road for us and we'll catch you later